hello hello everybody how are you hey guys what's the, it's sunday it's the lord's day hi everybody hi i just wanted to log on hey mtv hello i just wanted to log on and just like talk with you guys so you all can like get to know a bit of me more i tried to like take some pictures today so that's why i have my makeup done because usually usually i don't walk around the house with my makeup done and my edges done but i was like why would i waste this little face beat um usually i'm like in sweats and like i just look a hot ass mess but hi i just wanted to get on so we could like talk and hang together and you guys can like get to know me like the real me a bit more hey ashley so if you guys have like any questions or anything you want to talk about let me know nothing's off limits this is like a little open thing for us so i'm really happy you all are here with me and yeah, so I'm just chilling in my room. You see my little decorative pillows. Thank you guys. And yeah, so let's see. Let's see what questions you all have. Uh, Common? You always open the door. Come on, baby. Hello, Chloe. I'm having a really bad day. What advice do you have to make me get over my problems? I'm so, so sorry, number one. I love you. I would have to say what helps me is prayer and just like hanging out with my little brother and my god mom. That's what like helps me feel better. And you know, I feel like since we're like on the topic here, so I mean, we're all here, I guess, you know? So first, I just want to like thank all of you guys for all of your love and support. And I see what everybody is saying and I appreciate everyone who is sending me love and supporting me and loving me. And I just want to thank you all because it really means a lot to me. And I know like when we started our Instagrams, Marseille, hey girl, when we started our Instagrams, it was like something new and different for you guys and you kind of get to see like the different sides of sister and i you see how we're the same and you see how we're different and i think that's the beautiful thing about it because our synergy is really out of this world because you have two completely different individuals and you come together and you're like this so a lot of times you see what hallie and i are together so now you kind of get like a bit of inside on who I am as a person and there's been like a lot of talk and stuff about my Instagram and like my dance videos and stuff and the funny thing is the dancing one I did like with the blue light and everything I did that like six months ago I just shot it in my room because I really really love to dance and I feel like it's just I feel so confident when I get to tap into the sexier side of me because all the people who know me personally, I'm really like such a nerd and I'm really to myself and I'm really, really shy. So it is like, it's honestly, it's taken a lot for me to show the world who I kind of like really am inside. So that was like, that was taken like six months ago. And then the one that was posted yesterday, I shot that almost a year and seven months ago when I was like in North Carolina for a movie. So the thing is, you guys just get to kind of see who I really am as a person. And I'm, I, I'm really grateful for you all's support and love because it just wouldn't be right of me to show an image of me that I'm not like a made up, clean cut, image of me that I'm just not I'm just inside I'm such a nerd and I like I'm not worldly at all like ask anyone who knows me they think I'm like 50 years old in the head but when I perform and when I make music 
And when I dance, that's when I get to tap into the sexier side of myself. And that's where I find my confidence. I'm not gonna cry this time, because y'all know I'd be crying. So it really means a lot to me when I can finally get to a place where I share who I really am. And I've been like really insecure for a long time. And I'm finally like at that place where I have self-confidence. I'm not gonna cry. <laughs> and I'm really happy that I get to share that with you all. And I think it's so important and so special when a black woman can be strong and stand in her power in every single way. You know, I do it musically with my songwriting, with my producing, I feel so badass. And I get the same feeling when I dance in my room, when I just own who I am and my body. And for so long, I used to think I was like fat and like I used to hate my stretch marks and my cellulite. I'm not gonna cry. <sighs> but it's like now I really love who I am. And I don't post what I post for validation from anybody or even male attention, it's just me. And a lot of people who know, like, who's on my, like, private Instagram, they see, like, I'm just, that's how I find my confidence. Because it has taken me a lot to appreciate myself and my body. There's been so many times where I felt I wasn't pretty enough, where I just, I have a lot of issues with my weight. So it's really, it's a pivotal time for me. I'm just now learning at, like, 22 almost 23 that it's okay to be all that you are and to stand in that power and I, I I think that's why I'm so appreciative of all of you who've been supporting me and I'm not going to change who I am if I did I would be a catfish and you all wouldn't see the real me that my family sees that Hallie knows it's not a shock to her because she know like I'm like this all the time most of the stuff on my page anyways are like months and months old but i love you all so much that i want to invite you in and bring you all in and show you who i really really truly am i'm like i'm such a nerd inside but on the outside i love to like just even when i dance i just feel really sexy and confident that's where i get my confidence from ever since i was like a little girl since i was four i'd be shaking my butt in front of the tv watching my idol beyonce so it's just always been in like it's just always been a part of me and I think you all are just now seeing it and a lot of you all who have been showing support it means so 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 much and I think for every woman out there don't change who you are to make society feel comfortable and I'm telling myself that's not what I'm going to do and even when I posted the video yesterday I was posting it because I was saging and doing Pali Santo and I was like let's spread positive vibes I didn't even really notice you all would talk about my ass because I'm like oh, okay I'm just walking in for one second two seconds you know and I feel like I've shown my ass more than I have with that like if you look at our performance videos the last performance we had in December like I was just so excited and on stage and just being myself so I don't know I just felt it was important to address it so you guys get to kind of get to know who I am more in inside and it's really hard for me to think of myself as a sexual being or an attractive being quite frankly so when I see all the uproar about my posts and stuff I'm a bit confused like I really don't understand because I've never seen myself in that way or in that light so I take it as a huge compliment that you all even think of me as a sexual sexy being and you know it's never I don't post what I post for people to I don't post what I post for to get attention I don't need that I am a very spiritual person and I feel like during quarantine I got really close to God so even in the lowest moments when I felt like people weren't seeing me when people weren't paying attention to me God was and I've learned I don't need outside attention so you all seeing what I'm posting is just me being me and yeah I just hope you can 
just see who I am and that's it. So yeah, someone said,